Here, hold that. Good job. So, I was a little surprised by your total lack of curiosity when I said I had a weird dream that involved you. I don't remember you saying that. Oh, well, that could be why you were not that interested. Probably. You want to go stir fry? <coughs> We could take it to, to, to Starbucks. Yeah, that's actually a really good idea. So you're saying you want to go to Starbucks? Is there some reason why you're nodding like a bobblehead? Sorry, I don't need your answer in the form of something that's easily recorded. Oh, we're recording today? Yeah. Oh, okay. Not all of it, just for, because I was going to tell this story anyway. Okay. So, yeah, I had this. Yeah, let's go to stir fry. I'm so starving. The weird dream was uh, you showed up with your knitting stuff. Oh, my crochet. <clears throat> yeah, and you had knitted me a, um, you knitted me something and I was really excited. I thought it was going to be a scarf or a, um, like a bed spread or something. Uh -huh. And it was like a sock for my junk. Oh my god. And it had like a strap that went around the bottom with like a little button. Uh, you uh. Were, you were like really, uh, you were really like excited about that you had made it. And so you're like, all right, let's see it then. Uh, uh. I'm like, what do you mean? <laughs> Put it on. Like at first I'm looking at it and I'm thinking, because you hadn't finished it. Because you still, you know, how when people knit stuff, when it's done, it's all tied off. This is still attached to, to yarn and stuff. Oh, and I I'm, had to I'm make like, sure it fits. like, it's not finished. And you're like, oh, yeah, it, I got to make sure it fits. So I can make more of it if I need to. I guessed at the width, but I figure, you know, you don't want it too snug. And you said that like you had lots of experience. Like, like that was a rule. Uh -huh. Like when knitting a sock for your penis, you, you want to make sure, you don't want it to be a little loose. And you were talking about how the stuff was really soft and it's hypoallergenic and uh -uh. it absorbs sweat. And you're like, all right, let's see it. And I'm like, um, that would be weird. And you're like, <laughs> of course, but I mean, you want it to fit, right? And then you were like, I kind of need to see a little more. And I was like, well, that's, that's what I've got to work with right now. <laughs> you're like, well, you've got to kind of, you know, need to see the whole thing. And I was like, yeah, that's, um, and then you were like, well, you know, it gets bigger. And I'm like, where? Because you're explaining that to me because I'm the one with the penis. <laughs> you're like, all right, well, I can take off my shirt if that'll help. Uh-uh. And so then when you were done, you had the measurements and then you're like, all right, I'll, you know, this'll, this'll be big enough that when you're, and it had a little, it had a little button on the side that you slip the strap around and then uh, fasten it. <laughs> and at no point in this dream was I ever like, you know, I, it, it's weird. I've never actually needed my penis to be warmer than it is. <laughs> I have never like, cause I, cause I would just put a sock on it. Yeah. Entirely, or just wear underwear. Yeah, really. And I, I did try to explain some of that to you, and you're like, yeah, but this is, I made this by hand, and it's really soft. Yeah, because I use Burnett. And, uh, and it was pink. It was pink? And, and there were other colors, too. The one I made you was pink? Yeah, it was pink, and it was green, and like orange, and you're like, it goes equally well with everything. <laughs> Which was another weird thought as far as I was concerned, you know, dream-wise. Like, oh, I would say that's one of the weirder dream concepts I had. But I did dream that I invented something called Air Johnsons. Air Johnsons? Yeah, they're condoms that match the color scheme of Jordan shoes. So people who are like super matchy-matchy when they're going out to the club can be like, I'm rocking the new Jordans. 
you know, they're like purple and orange or whatever, or green and whatever. And then you can get condoms that exactly match those same colors. Because being matchy matchy is really important to some people. That's true. And if they're gonna spend 300 bucks on shoes, why not spend money on condoms that match? Yeah, then they'll be then they'll be willing to throw their money at me for condoms that match. <laughs> weird, weird dreams. So I still can't believe you dreamt that I made a sock for your dick. That's the part that bothers you about that dream. That's the part that bothers you? That okay. and the fact that I wanted you to get hard. Well, it wasn't, like, creepy. You just wanted to make sure it fits. I mean, there's a lot of knitting that you've got to do. I have no idea. That was it? That was the dream? That was weird. Yeah. That's hella weird. I re Sorry, you're wearing a hat with a gold pair on it. <laughs> you, you know that that's not the sort of hat that, like, non-gangster people wear. In gold. It's got gold lame on it, too. You, okay. It's a hat. Leave it alone. No, I mean, it's a hat. It's a gangster hat. It's like... That's, uh, it's badass. If you were a cholo, that would be awesome. Yes, What's I am your, going to put makeup on and be a cholo. What does your shirt say? Like a boss. Have when was the last time you did anything like a boss? Like just do you remember? Not for a while. Yeah. Just saying. What size is it? Five. You were in a five X T shirt? Yeah. I kind of feel like any slogan on a 5X t-shirt is really not to be believed. Just saying. I mean, like a boss with a 5X. It's like, like a boss, slowly. <laughs> I had to work up to it. I was like a boss, eventually. <laughs> that's, that's really... Um... 5X? It's roomy. <laughs> yeah, for a family of Armenians who just moved here. No, not really. See, it's got some room, but... It's got, got some lost. room. <laughs> well, because it's a guy's shirt, so it's got... I have, I've got, like, the top side. I take up the top. Guys, like, don't have the top. But they've got the bottom. You've got that hat just really. You're just really obsessed with the hat, aren't you?